Hello. <laughs> I was gonna do a face on, but I have like nothing on, and I'm just I just worked out, so I'm just gonna speak like this. But look at the duck that Christine got me. So cute. Lunch time. I've been addicted to this cauliflower pizza. It's so hard to eat just one piece. I want more. Um, I used to have four big luggages, but I threw one out because it was like really old and just like it was time to go. So unfortunately, now I have to use my smaller checked carry-on luggage for, as a checked. Unfortunately, because I couldn't fit everything, but usually I just fit my pin container into the one side and then anything that needs to be checked like liquids um, I really need to carry separately like carry-on liquids and stuff but I'm so lazy at the moment so I just check them in so my makeup and everything is over there and then my clothes um, Josh's clothes so everything's in there so the three luggages are here I'm gonna open them again just to show you guys like how things are divided kinda so you guys can Maybe in the future, if you want to do a con, you can just kind of look at how I distribute things and pack things. So this is the first bag. It's like one of the smaller big bags I've had. Um, I have some mystery bags that are hidden here and there because it's just easier to put this in one space. And then this whole thingy is for my keychains that are too big to go into my other smaller bins. And the washi tapes go here too. I really recommend these art bins, but I do also recommend you measuring your luggage size so that you can fit two into one. I always have this problem where like I can only fit one and I have this like awkward space and I don't think it's like oh, very practical. And then if you open this, I have the some of the setup boards I have in here. These are really heavy, so then I try to like distribute them evenly throughout the luggages I carry so that it doesn't get too heavy and it gets close to like 50 pounds because that's what you want to avoid and then you open it and then there's all my sun catcher displays, price displays some cloth for my cover and in case they don't have a tablecloth I can use that instead and then minor setup stuff so that's the first bag this weighed about like 40 pounds. This is my biggest bag, which obviously is why I can fit two bins, luckily, but I really got lucky with it because I didn't measure anything before buying my art bins, so I really recommend you guys like measuring everything if you're gonna be going to a con. This wrapped thing contains my keychain displays. I don't like stacking them directly on top of each other because the plane moves a lot and there's like a high chance of like damage and things falling off so then I wrap them in these cloths like one by one like over and over and over and over and then put them in here and then under that we have more like setups boards that are distributed here's my business cards and then some clips so then I try to put it in the pocket where like it zips up so that it doesn't like move around as much compared to like this section Ugh. so then this one was 47 degrees not degrees sorry um pounds so it barely 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 made it um i really just barely make it every single time apparently but these are where my buttons are things that can't like fold i'll go in here like i said in my last vlog like map button sets and then if you look more there's like microfiber cloth stickers my sun catchers also are in here birthday cards greeting cards and then this is another art bin that has all my keychains this art bin in particular is my favorite because it has like both sides so one side you can put a bunch of keychains and then on the other side you can put another i bought these at joann's yeah i bought these at joann's i forgot what the name is i'll show you real quick this is what it's called if you guys are interested in buying them and I'll try to link it but I bought this so long ago that I probably don't have the email anymore so that's the second bag this is the last one um, I finally have beanies with me so then not to sell them so 
Um, I put bucket hats. These are mine, so I put them for up, up for display. But under this, there's another bin with air fresheners, washi tape, and my post-its. This time, I packed a lot because I had a lot in stock. And I've heard that Level Up gets busy, so we'll see. But this other side is my typical like keychain stack, like you can see here, like the organized keychains. This will slowly retire, I think, as I sell out these and then switch over to the art bins that I had. And then glassine paper, big size for the hats, smaller size for keychains. And then my bucket hats all are here. I, my reversible pre-orders apparent, unfortunately didn't make it in time, so this will do. And this was 35 pounds, it was pretty light. Okay, so here are some other things that I carry around, but in my bag, I don't check these in because it just, yeah, some just makes sense to just carry by yourself. So first thing is in this pouch, I have some chargers for my portable charger. I have my um, small, why is it so bright? Um, how do you decrease? There we go. This is my uh, square. So then this is the dock for it. The dock doesn't fit in here, so I carry it separately. But you just slide it in and it's just so much easier to like get payments. You can just leave it like that and then that's all you need to do. So then I charge it the night before so that it can function. It usually lasts a pretty long time. I might actually consider getting a hotspot because some of my my AT&T service has been really poor at the past two cons so I had to end up getting like Wi-Fi at the con which was really expensive so I would recommend a hotspot if you have AT&T unfortunately so that goes in here and then there goes the charger too so these two go into my bag and then this is just my um, yearbook but for like cons I like like to get signatures from artists that I meet for each con so then I can remember them and I can like Oh, this is supposed to go into my... Hold on. Um, so I can remember them and like just... I just think it's cute. And then that's there. And then this one I recently like decided on. It was my Polaroid like album, but I wasn't really using this one. So I changed it into like a business card collection where like you can collect all the people you meet at like con conventions and then you can keep all their business cards right here so that you can remember them and take them out and check out where their shop is and stuff. And then most important but not really talked about because security reasons is cash. You want to have enough cash so that you can be prepared to give change. A lot of people actually pay in cash than you expect so I would always recommend carrying a lot of ones Chase Bank specifically for me at least they there's like a machine with, during the work hours where you can get like smaller cash in a lot in like a huge amount so I just go in and get around like 200 to 300 dollars and like 100 ones within that amount and then like 25s and then like 220s and like whatever adds up to the amount that you need and then I just bring this in my bag and then I deposit it at the end of con so cash I always recommend you either have a fanny pack where it's like stuck onto your body all the time I personally don't really trust the cash box because if people just take it they just take it I just feel more comfortable with the cash being on my body at all times so it's really up to your comfort level, but I would never, never, never check these. Never check these. And then never leave it overnight either. Just leave your inventory overnight. And this should never, ever, ever, ever be off your body, in my opinion, because money is important. And then last thing, not really necessary unless you, I don't know, but I think it's nice to have. You should, um, carry portable chargers. I have two, one because I thought I lost the other one. Oh my god, why it's so loud? 
Um, one, because I thought I lost this one, but it turns out I had it all this time, so now I have two. So I really recommend portable chargers because you just never know, you know, your phone could be out of battery, and if your phone's out of battery, you can't take square sales unless you have a terminal. So I would recommend always carrying around your charger, your portable charger, cable, whatever, and I think two of these actually feels a lot reassuring than just having one. So I would recommend getting two. One thing I really recommend is this, I want to focus, this um, thingy, which is a weight measure for luggages. So then if you turn it on, you can change it to either like pounds, kilograms, oh my god, can this like focus? Pounds, kilograms and stuff, and then I just like lift up the luggage and then it can just measure the weight for me. Um, super convenient, really small too, and I'm always like scared of being overweight with my luggages, so... Hello... Dinner... Made musubi... Sausages... so suburban in my life. <laughs> Very curious. It's a vending machine for pizza. Late dinner time. Goodbye, my hard work on the incline. Yay, pizza. Oh, that's yours. Go to the fire. Yay! I feel so vlog. We're here. Got a packet. Yay! Half of my setup had to get creative, but it worked out. Yay! That luggage is empty now. And then these two are my inventory. Keychains. And then hat. Sign. Microfiber is gonna go there. Washi. I'll take care of that tomorrow. Pins. Yeah. It's our badges. Here's mine. And then the strap is really cute. I'll show you tomorrow though. And then we're done. We covered it up. Kind of weirdly, but. It sends the message. Cover the back too. Hey, Josh found this place. Looks so good. 
Okay. When we send the card, there will be a transaction fee. Is that okay? Oh, that's fine. Fifty-two. Oh, that looks so good. Chicken. Should we eat? Yes. Looks so good. It's from lunch. Oh yeah. Yeah, you're definitely feeling sleepy from lunch. Wow. Hangul Sarah Manya, Shin Lim. I know, that's what I was thinking yesterday. Wow, Shingir. Josh, it's so cool. It's like a, a trip. It's like a sky, but not really a sky. Whoa. That's cool, too. Wow. Wow, it's dark. I've never felt such foresty vibes till today. It's so pretty. Machines. Cocktail bar. Can I see your drink? Ah. Cucumber? I like how it's like very different times of the day. Is that on purpose? That's so cool. This is so cool. And it has fish. Real fish. Is that a ray? Oh my god. Fishy. It's a fake version of that fountain in. Uh, oh, in Italy. In not Italy. Is it Italy? Yeah. Oh, okay.
This is why I have a square beforehand. Oh my god, game fuel. Yay! Set up is done. It's ready. We changed things up a little bit. The buttons now go on the screen because it's just easier that way. And microfiber class. More post-it, washi tape, hair fresheners, and then my hat, beanies, finally, they, this kind of looks weird but it's like whatever at this point. And then some more keychains, everything is in one section which is satisfying. It's a little high up but maybe it's just because I'm short so maybe it'll be fine. And that, yeah, it's ready, it's all ready. Back of our booth. My POV. Commentary is so funny. <laughs> Chains all here. Beanies and hats there. Nobody bought them yet. It's 3 p.m. Hi, Josh. So slow. I'm so sleepy. I think we need sugar-free coffee. Maybe like a maybe I'll be Korean for once and buy like Americano tomorrow. Americano. Yeah. Wow, this is very HD. <laughs> The cane staff came and gave us a free meal. I am so happy. Friday was slow, but this is like the highlight of my day. This is amazing. Customer also gave me these cute gummy bears that she made. They're so cute. Josh and I got each one. Now 7.42, it picked up a little towards like 4 p.m. and then it got really busy and I made the quota that I was thinking in my head so that's good. And tomorrow I should bring a tripod because this is, I'm holding it with my hand. Um, I definitely had a higher expense this time because I brought my boyfriend with me but Normally I would have broke even by now, but unfortunately that's not the case, but we're here for a good time, not a long time. So we're just gonna laugh about it. Closing. Putting up cloth. It looks kind of weird, but it is what it is. Cat! Hello! brought this instead of my room key so I had to beg people to scan me out Bruh. good morning it's time for breakfast my favorite time of the year it's the cafe food it was really expensive Finally here. <laughs> oh, the buttons. Dude, 
Wait. Amy gave me this print. So cute. And I keep wander. I don't know where Ivy's table is. I keep going. I'm always so lost for so no fucking reason. Ivy. Don't mind me. I've been looking for this booth and she is finally here. Yay! Found the cutest, cutest booth. <laughs> so cute. I like these small ones. The It looks so good. Oh. oh, you even have the needles. Very hectic lunch in the back because it's so busy. It's busy. A lot of people going back and forth. It is now 5.15. It was really busy. But I finally ate. Hello. I'm running low on battery, so I'll stop here. It is now 7.20. The hall is going to close in 40 minutes. I checked in for my flight because I'm leaving early tomorrow. But yeah. <laughs> Josh has been working hard. I'm able to pee in peace. My food. A lot of these sold out. Some washi tape sold out. And then the one piece, as always, is close to selling out. The only thing left is like the display. I ran out of battery on my camera. The second day is done. Yay! Covered up. Hopefully, they take the trash. Yeah, time for dinner. I feel gaggy. It's really bad now. Dad! I'm born in Orange County. Orange County. I'm born in Vietnam. Hello. Shall we go? I'm realizing I like Americanos. <laughs> Last day. It's so far. I'm ready. I'm ready to go home. Level up. Whoa, does it move? Day 
take three started. Finally, our last day. I am so tired. I'm so ready to go home. My booth for day three. Um, a lot of post-its sold out. So then I like to mark that there's only a few left so that people are more inclined to buy them. And then some washi tape sold out. And then the One Piece shaker sold out. I just need them to buy the display. And then buttons too. They did better than I thought. Actually, the beanies did a lot better than I thought they would. Keychains. Pochito sold out really fast. Should have gotten more. And then more keychains. I like this display a lot. Like that overarching middle makes a lot of sense now. Oh. <laughs> That overarching middle makes sense and it just feels like it's bringing everything like together. Okay, I'm... <laughs> and then, yeah. Dining is strange. But day three. Apparently the line is long. I forgot that there's a holiday tomorrow. So then, I thought Sunday would be slow, but maybe I can look forward to it. He's already hungry. <gasps> Thank you! Last time, we door dashed. It's nice to have a helper that can get food for you. <laughs> Pro tip, do not buy noodle soup at a con. I'm so scared. So cute, a kid gave this to me. Oh, so cute! We all got Popeye's chicken sandwich when it first came out. Oh, yeah! That was. So that's three years ago. It was during quarantine, I remember. Once again, flight attendants are going to remain seated as we climb to our trip. 